week, the Abby Lee Dance Company was a real hit in Chicago at Energy Dance. Finally, overall high score, junior groups. I'm really proud of my girls. But now it's a new week, and it's time for my favorite thing. Let's move on to the pyramid. I'm sure that my kids will be on the bottom of the pyramid this week, but I'm back because my girls want to dance with their friends, and that's what they're going to do. First, we have Brooke. Probation, no solo this week. Paige, same thing. I don't think it's fair that Abby put my sister and I on probation because we had nothing to do with the argument my mom and her had. Brooke, Paige, you didn't do your routines. Nobody got to see them. Please welcome Paige. Thank you. Judges, please skip ahead to entry number 428. This is Brooke performing. Paint the pictures. I think that Abby thinks that she's hurting me by putting my kids on probation. They didn't not do their solos because they weren't prepared. Where are the stoppers? I'll have them for the competition. Done! Go get paid. Okay. You're, you're finished. Neither of my kids are doing a group dance. You're not doing a solo. Let's go, Brooke. They didn't do their solos because of unfair treatment. Well, regardless, it doesn't matter. Kelly was out of control. She used vulgarity and profanity in the dance studio. Therefore, those two kids were on probation. Chloe? For two weeks, my daughter has been at the top of the pyramid, and she misses one rehearsal, and she goes straight to the bottom row. Sure, Abby, that's fair. Last Monday, you went to the doctor, then you went to the movies. That's ridiculous. You need to be in class, not at the movie theater. I don't know if Chloe really went to the doctors or if she was playing hooky and went to the movies. All I do know is you're on the bottom row, kid. Mackenzie did a great job, but it still wasn't your best. You need to be in more ballet classes. Nia, you're here because you worked very well with Mackenzie. I gave you a role. You were the ringmaster in a circus. Some may say it's a little immature for you, but I love the fact that you embraced it that you had fun with it, and that you were entertaining to the audience. Mia is placed on a pyramid. It means a lot to her. And seeing herself on the second row, I'm happy for her. I'm happy to see that joy in her eyes. And at the top of the pyramid, we have Maddie. I'm really not surprised that Maddie's